I'm sure you can all relate to problem areas like this. Here we have an exposed area in the garden. We're next to the roadside, we've got noise and prying eyes. The solution to this is to plant a hedge, which gives you instant screening and gives you back your privacy. Today we're going to show you how to plant a hedge using our premium laurel blocks. So these are our premium laurel hedging blocks, grown in our nursery in Yorkshire for approximately eight years. They've been trimmed and clipped yearly to give you solid, dense hedge. So this is what your laurel blocks going to look like when it arrives in your garden. It's simply being wrapped with meshing to keep the branches in and tightly packed so we don't have any damage in transport. So this is a root ball. The plant has been carefully lifted along with its roots and soil and wrapped in hessian and wire to create the root ball. So the first step to planting your hedge is to dig a trench. Today I've got my trusty assistant Paul to help me. So Paul, what size do we need this trench? Well the trench needs to be a foot's width at each side of the root ball and no deeper than the root ball. Right. Obviously, please be careful so that you don't damage any of your leaves or branches. We're going to simply cut down the laurel. Really important tip do not remove anything on the root ball. So now you've unwrapped the laurel block, it's time to choose the best side and position it accordingly in the, in the trench. It's a good idea to half backfill around the root ball to keep the laurel block straight. Once your blocks are in place and you're happy with them, can then fully backfill the trench and stamp the soil back down. So there you have it, an instant laurel hedge. Doesn't it look fantastic? The next step is watering. So for plants of this size, you're going to need to give them a really good soak in. We'd recommend about 16 litres per plant, which is about two of these watering cans. 